Hey Scorpio, <clears throat> welcome back. I hope you guys are doing well today. Let's tap into your energy sports. Let's see what's going on with you guys. Alrighty. Um, thank you guys for your love, your support, your donations, and your super thanks for I am sending all that love and light back to you all tenfold. Okay. So let's see what's going on for my squirts. Happy birthday to you guys once again. Okay. <laughs> let's see. Spirit guides, angels, ancestors, ascended masters, gods and goddesses. Please return any spell work, any dark magic that is sent to harm Scorpio and their loved ones. Me and my loved ones return it back to the sender. Block any interferences that could be stopping the messages from coming through. Clear, concise, and precise messages from my Scorpios. And protect me as I channel the messages for Scorps. What's going on for Scorpio? All right, so we have deep thinking, thinking twice on a decision, preoccupied with one's thoughts, self-reflection, being analytical and logical. What are you thinking about? Guarded, protected, cautious. What else? Birth. New opportunities, starting over, reinventing yourself, birth of a child, idea, or project. So, um, <clears throat> you could be trying to get something off the ground here, Scorps, but for whatever reason you feel guarded, I mean, you feel like you have to guard yourself or protect, or maybe you do have to protect whatever this is. Um, maybe keep something close to your chest. I feel like, um, you could be experiencing a blockage here when it comes down to what you're trying to create or do. Maybe you're, you're overthinking, you're in deep thought. Instead of just relaxing and doing it. Let's see. What's birth? What kind of birth is this? Okay. Hang your wings. Misbehaving. Naughty. Okay. Up in the air. Not knowing where you stand. Situation or decision still undecided. Uncertain about something. Lacking stability. So there could be... There could be some sort of behaviors that you have to put to the side in order to birth whatever this is that's new. Okay, whatever you're trying to do, you could be needing to change up something that you're already doing or or, or let something go. Yeah, because it's time for you to step into your purpose. Exactly. Date night, romance, going out and learning. So there could be somebody here that you're dating that's going to teach you a lot. Okay. There could be somebody too <clears throat> that's around you that still is like they don't know what they want. What's guarded? It's like the decision is still up in the air type shit. The fuck? Disputes, conflict, pain. Loyalty. Trustworthy friends. Okay, yeah. So you can have a trustworthy people around you, but because there's some sort of conflict or pain that you're still feeling. You could be guarded and you're you're thinking deeply about this, which is good. That means you're aware of it. So, yeah. Let's see what else. Knowledge, flip that in the reverse. Okay, learning, study, that's in the reverse. What else? Serendipity, divine intervention, perfect timing. Happy surprises, a fortunate stroke of luck. Waiting game. Okay, so the wait is over about something. Waiting for someone or something. Expecting to hear news, putting your life on hold, prepare, ready, and waiting. So I don't know, somebody's waiting for you to like leave a situation behind or waiting for you to fail at something, but I feel like you're not. Something is getting ready to happen in divine timing. It could be with a relationship. Okay, since those two people are standing there under a rainbow, you could be seeing a lot of rainbows because it has been raining a lot. I've actually seen a few rainbows myself. So I feel like with knowledge, learning, and study, somebody cannot study you. They cannot see something about this connection, about this relationship. There's a higher power, yeah, protecting it. Possibly. Or somebody here hasn't learned from, they haven't learned something, so you're not waiting on some on someone anymore. What's waiting game in the reverse? There's no point in you waiting on their ass. 
Yeah, abundance in the reverse. Your arrival to abundance, financial blessings, rewards for your efforts, money flows easily into your life. So that's in the reverse. Okay, what's waiting game in reverse with the okay, blown away, amazed, unexpected. Yeah, so somebody's losing money or they they missed out on the opportunity to gain abundance. Okay. Yeah, endings change transformation. What's serendipity? Betrayal in the reverse. Okay, good. Deceit, jealousy. That's in the reverse. Divine timing and new level. Yeah, so something is happening to with you and someone here. Whatever you guys are birthing together with your part. I feel like you're with somebody here, Scorpio, or this could be future energy. Whatever this is right here is happening in divine timing. So there's just a need for you to be patient. I feel like um, somebody could be shocked or amazed. I'm like, wow, I can't believe I'm, get, I'm I'm missing this opportunity or I can't believe this person is not waiting for me or I can't believe I've been sitting here waiting for something to fall apart and it hasn't yet and it's not going to, bitch. So I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Mm. It's time to get over it. What's, what else here for sports? Because, <laughs> yeah, hot mess. Disorderly habits, untidy mind, chaotic or messy situation, feeling miserable and unhappy, being irresponsible. What, what's, what else? Crossroads. Faced with choices, mist of indecision, facing the possibilities in life, right of initiation. And disappearing, act outcast, ghosting. Bottom of the deck, yeah, throw it out, cut ties, not good for you, and the devil, and the phoenix. So yeah, you could be cutting out like old habits, any kind of nasty, toxic ways that you have, or bad habits, or any obsession, dependencies, addictions. I feel like you're you're the phoenix rising from the ashes here. Okay, there could be also somebody around you that has these issues that you're throwing out in the trash. You're not thinking about their ass no more. You're done trying to help them or whatever the fuck this is. Yeah, you're you're yeah, you're going into a new contract here where there's going to be extra blessings. So I feel like, yeah. I feel like, you know. Somebody's trying to figure out what the fuck they're going to do or because they're stuck. Somebody's at a crossroads. Or maybe you could be at a crossroads here about yourself, Scorpio. Like, you could be a hot mess. You could be, like, feeling, like, I don't know, disorderly shit all over the place. And you could want to disappear and leave something behind. But I feel like you shouldn't. I feel like somebody else is projecting their energy on to you too so there's that so let's see yeah we got the three of swords libra saturn so there, there's a breakup here or somebody's like heartbroken Three of Swords, Five of Pentacles Reverse, and the Queen of Swords. So there's something here that you're saying, or you're you're addressing something about healing. It's like you're speaking up or you're you're expressing yourself. Some of you guys are really feeling vulnerable right now. There's a need for you to be honest with yourself about maybe you need to you needing to heal from some sort of heartbreak or pain or whatever somebody here needs to do some sort of positive words like positive affirmations okay i'm getting that that'll really work out well for you here post them on your mirror in the morning or whatever so you can see it when you wake up or do that first thing in the morning write down on some sticky notes some positive affirmations but let's see what's deep thinking with this right here Okay, right. So, sabotage. Eight of Swords. Self-imposed imprisonment. Overthinking, like I said. This could be like fear. Paranoia. Or you feeling silenced. Or, or still having this victim mentality. When you're not a victim, you're a victor. Yeah, what else here? Yeah, the Five of Pentacles in reverse. Exactly. You didn't already came from out of the cold. Or you're... I don't know. But it's like you still are thinking a certain way. Yeah, so because the Five of Pentacles in reverse talks about healing or coming out of some sort of financial hardship. If you were homeless, 
yeah there's gonna be no more of that or this could be you healing from some sort of illness for some of you yeah this is the high priestess in reverse seven of cups could be self-doubt or um somebody here have an uncontrollable outburst because of an illusion okay what's the eight of swords Oh, okay, so black ass magic. Hmm. Page of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, the side priest could be that. Yeah, somebody doing black magic, but this could be definitely a lot of divination spine. But I'm get I'm getting somebody here doing magic. This could be too procrastination. Maybe this is like a, a plan or a strategy that's not working or something like that because there's a need for you to stop procrastinating or whatever. This is. This could be procrastination. You're not jumping in at an opportunity. You're letting your mind get in the way. What's the eight of swords with the page of pentacles reverse? The justice. Libra. Somebody here could be getting bad news and earthly matters. Or somebody here could be getting ready to go to jail. The police could be taking away somebody's money or taking everything that somebody earned away from them. Well, they, obviously they didn't earn it or something. Yeah, look, a thief. So the justice is taking accountability or something is balanced out, something is fair, it's just. Somebody here getting some bad news. Maybe somebody, I, I keep getting, somebody is trying to do some sort of justice magic to make things go in their favor because they don't want to get locked up. What's this justice? Okay, the Eight of Wands. What's justice here with the Eight of Wands? Some of you guys could be getting a document or a letter sent in from the court about how somebody's in jail. What's the the justice with the Eight of Wands? Or I don't know. But this could be, um, yeah, the fool. Whatever this is, I feel like you don't give a fuck. It's going to free you. But the fool is definitely a new beginning. Um, You're doing something new with your time, your energy, your life. This is spontaneity. Um taking action and just being vibrant this is like joyful energy some of you guys could be getting ready to have some fun or go on a trip or whatever but i just feel like you're free and you're moving forward in a positive direction with the eight of wands yeah or somebody here could be coming out of jail and somebody else is going in <laughs> like or something like that if it's not literal jail it could just be feeling like wherever you was at you felt trapped or stuck or whatever so, yeah, I feel like you're free. Something is fair for you. I feel like you're free. So somebody else is stuck and they feel like, I guess they probably feel like it's unfair that they're stuck. What's Page of Pentacles reverse? Okay, yeah, the death card. Okay, somebody's doing death magic or everything around somebody is ending. It's coming to an end. Scorpio, this could be another Scorpio here on some dumb shit or this is you going through a death and a rebirth, a transformation. What's Page of Pentacles reverse death card? <clears throat> yeah. Oh, okay, you're a criminal. Not a swords in reverse. Yeah, somebody's like attacking you. <clears throat> you guys could be seeing 888, but I feel like it's going right back. Or you could be feeling the attacks. And if you do feel it, I feel like just pay attention to what it is attacking. What is actually going on in your life right now that you might need to work on, right? Because if it's still bothering you, then I feel like there's some work that needs to be done. And that's good. Work on it. So that way you don't have to worry about this shit again. You know that it's an attack. You know that somebody's doing some nasty shit to you to play with your head. So don't even worry about it. I feel like maybe somebody's trying to silence you or make you feel scared or nervous or whatever this dumb shit is. But somebody's definitely a criminal. Somebody has a criminal background or they're a bully. This is somebody here that's a follower. They're a coward. Okay. Mm -hmm. so somebody here could have hurt somebody. Somebody could be going to jail for like murder or some shit. Or, I don't know. This Knight of Swords in reverse, too. This is somebody that leads other people to danger. Definitely, um, you could be going through a change and a, a death and a rebirth and learning how to just go with the flow of things. Okay, maybe, yeah, that's probably what you need to do. But, mm -hmm. somebody here feels like they know everything or they have some sort of inferiority complex. Child, what's this five pentacles reverse? The tower. What's five pentacles reverse with the tower? Aries, Scorpio. 
The five of cups in reverse. Yeah, so I feel like you are truly healing, Scorpio. There's something that's being released. You guys could be seeing five by five. And it's causing a tower. Because somebody here is thinking that they're attacking you or whatever. And they could be attacking you. But I feel like every time they attack you, it's going backwards because you're doing whatever you need to do to heal. Like somebody's trying to affect you emotionally or mentally or whatever the fuck. Or physically. And it's not working. It's not working. So somebody, what? They're shocked or... This tower is like, it's chaos, it's destruction, it's something here falling apart. What's the tower? Or you could be going through a tower, but it's pushing you to heal. Yeah, what's, what's the tower? Yeah, oh, okay, the King of Cups in reverse. Yeah, somebody emotionally unavailable. It could be a Scorpio. This is another Scorpio. So somebody emotionally unavailable, very much so immature. They're, they're emotionally, uh, they're a gaslighter. Very emotionally abusive, manipulative. Whoever this is, is very fucking ruthless. Let me see. So they're shocked that what? You're healing from them and you moved on? This person keep on trying to attack you? What's the King of Cups reverse with the tower? So they, their life is falling apart or, yeah, Page of Souls in reverse. I feel like this person getting bad news after bad news after bad news. Nothing is working. Nothing is working. This person is scatterbrained. All their gifts are, are gone. They lost their gifts. If somebody's conjuring up negative spirits, I feel like that shit is going right on back. <laughs> I don't know what somebody called themselves doing. But this person could be maliciously gossiping about you or they're sending you the evil eye. Or um, this could be somebody that you're not even talking to. You're not speaking to them because they're going through a tower. They're going through something bad. So I guess they ain't got time to talk. This person don't can't see from they left from their damn right. They going through it. And somebody I feel like somebody is scared that they're going to jail. This somebody is going to jail. The five of swords in reverse, nine of swords in the judgment. This could definitely be trial. Some somebody's going to trial, maybe, or this somebody just has court. They're under judgment. I don't know. Maybe this is spiritual law. What's five of cups reverse? Yeah, the King of Swords in the reverse. What's Five of Cups reverse? King of Swords reverse. Okay, yeah, the Two of Swords. Yeah, somebody here is stuck. They're trapped. This could be two. This person is working with like a corrupt lawyer or judge, or they're working with somebody that know how to like play with the system, or know how to beat the system, or whatever the case. But I feel like this person is is dumb. Like they don't know what the fuck they're doing <laughs> at all. If that's the case. I feel like somebody's trying to beat a court case. That shit is going not going to work. But this King of Swords in reverse, too, is somebody that's very, like, overly critical. They're very judgmental. Very hypocritical. Somebody that's, like, scatterbrained. Somebody made a really made a really dumb decision. They made the wrong decision. <clears throat> and they're stuck. They're trying to like somebody's a liar. They're lying here. Their heart chakra is closed, closed off. They don't know which way to go. They don't know what to do or which way to, like, somebody is tripping. Excuse me. Yeah, they're going through a tower, man. This could be where this person, where things are up in the air with them. You don't know where things are going to go. And so I feel like, yeah, you really need to let this person go or whatever this is. <clears throat> mm. What's this knowledge here in the reverse of serendipity, betrayal, abundance, reverse, waiting game, and a blown away? <clears throat> Yeah, the Ace of Wands in reverse. So, yeah, somebody is trapped somewhere. They're stuck. This is, too, a lack of chemistry or a lack of desire for something, passion. This is a disinterest. What else? Yeah, the Magician. Yeah, you have strong clarity. You have a strong mindset as well. I feel like you know what you want to manifest. And you're keeping your eyes on the prize here. Your manifestations are coming in, I feel. But this is you having mental clarity of where you want to go and what you want to do. You're really disinterested in something. You have no interest in something anymore. And it's, it's to the point now where it's just baggage. So if you're still carrying this around or carrying out hope that it's going to be something, I feel like you need to let that shit go. Yeah, let it go. What's the Ace of Wands reverse? Or somebody, okay. Oh, okay, the Queen of Wands in reverse. 
So somebody's disinterested. Somebody's not getting turned on by a queen of wands in the reverse. Yeah, somebody's like breaking up with someone. Ooh. Ooh -wee. What's the ace of wands in reverse, queen of wands reverse? Yeah, five of wands in reverse. So I feel like you're not going to be fighting with no damn queen of wands in reverse about no damn king of swords in reverse, king of cups in reverse, ass motherfucker, knight of swords reverse. I feel like you have no interest in this damn man over here. I feel like that's what this bitch is arguing about or upset about or something like that. <clears throat> this could be too. The queen of wands in reverse, five of wands in reverse, somebody here could be extremely aggressive. Like when they're not having sex, when they're not getting the dick that they want or when they... When they feel like somebody is not interested in them, they don't know how to take rejection. Neither does this King of Cups either. They both got the same problem. Somebody's like very insecure. They're a bully. This could be like somebody trying to extremely come, to like be extremely aggressive towards you. But I feel like this this person right here, this Queen of Wands in reverse, they want to uh, compromise or work something out or whatever. But somebody's like disinterested. What's the, what's the Queen of Wands reverse? <laughs> what is going on? Yeah, the Ten of Cups. What's Queen of Wands reverse Ten of Cups? Or this could be you where you need to work on your insecurity, Scorpio. Yeah, the lovers in reverse. Yeah, your trust issues. Or there's somebody stealing your energy that don't know what the fuck they want and they're projecting on your Ten of Cups. Because I feel like you feel whole, complete, or happy, but you can still have trust issues here. With the lovers in the reverse. Or maybe you are still undecided. Or I don't know. But the Ten of Cups is upright. So I feel like that, that represents wholeness. It's happiness. It's completion. Or you got the life that you want to have with somebody. But I feel like there's still trust issues here that you need to look at. It's still something lingering. Okay. Or this is a lack of accountability. Or being indecisive disharmony and discord yeah mm. what's this love is reverse the hierophant what's love is reverse hierophant <laughs> the judgment child Taurus here, we got Scorpio, Aries, Leo, Sag. So, yeah, I feel like with the Hierophant and the Judgment, there is a really big lesson here. This Hierophant could be a counterpart of yours, too. There's a really deep spiritual awakening that's happening here. There's a lesson that's being learned. Or I feel like with the Judgment, this talks about renewal, okay, and your purpose. You're gaining, gaining wisdom from experience or you already have the wisdom, but I feel like you're Something something within you is clearing out. Yeah, it's, it's this betrayal, this hardship, this pain. I'm getting like the Ten of Swords in reverse. You're healing from something here. And this counterpart is helping you, this Hierophant. Your your faith and your trust is, is really significant right here. You need to have faith in something. The judgment is making a clear decision. This talks about too, self-awareness. Definitely learning from your, your past mistakes here or um, learning some sort of karmic lessons. And I feel like you're stepping into your purpose with this Hierophant or you are this Hierophant. Yeah, this person, there's some deep purging going on, man. This is like really a uh, deep purging. So a lot of your insecurities are coming up to the surface. <laughs> a lot of things are coming up that you need to look at about yourself, possibly. It could be. I keep getting that in a lot of readings. Okay, you're understanding what the blockages are or Yeah. But for others of you, this Queen of Wands in reverse is mad that you don't want to go toe to toe with them about this weak ass emperor in reverse, this King of Souls reverse, King of Cups reverse. I feel like you don't got time for that shit. King of Pentacles reverse, somebody's distorted and a raggedy. I feel like you ain't going back and forth with no bitch about no damn loser ass little boy. What's what's the magician? So I feel like I feel like there was a, definitely a big lesson here in this, okay? And it could still be plaguing you, so you need to heal. You need to do some healing or whatever. Yeah, like page of wands in reverse. What's the magician with page of wands in reverse? 
somebody here missed an opportunity with you and they, i feel like they're trying to figure out like how to call a truce or how to come back and i feel like it's a no yeah look ace of swords reverse yeah so this is scatterbrain energy or frustration or somebody keeps on repeating the same lessons over and over again it's starting to be like redundant there's something that's going on that's redundant i feel like somebody's environment is chaotic as fuck too with the ace of swords in reverse but there's something that's definitely predictable about somebody's behavior somebody there, there will be no damn breakthrough there will be no victory somebody's not getting something out of you they're not you know, i feel like you don't want to talk to them or anything like that you don't have nothing to say to them especially because they put you in a third party i feel like you don't want to say shit to this person you don't have nothing to say so yeah your mind is very strong when it comes down to this I feel like you're realizing too that whoever this hierophant is and the judgment, because I don't know why I'm getting that's a person. This person right here is definitely either they're a higher level soulmate or they're a twin. This person is really deeply healing you, like from the core, from the bottom to the top. It's like you're being cleansed. Yeah, so you can break free of whatever the shit is right here that you've been through. You're ready for the, for the next phase. You maybe don't feel like it because this shit is hard, but you know what they say, like the healthiest relationships, they hard because you, you've had to heal or you still are healing from the worst kind of relationships you could ever have. So those be, these be the hardest relationships, boy, I'm telling you. The healthy ones are hard. Love, real love takes work. It's not easy breezy. So what's a hot mess here with crossroads and disappearing act? Now somebody is stuck. They don't know what the fuck to do. I feel like somebody is lacking energy or something like that. Like they need energy. But I just feel like, yeah, nine of swords, Gemini, Mars, what else? And the ace of cups in reverse. Yeah, there's a breakup. There's a breakup or this is like unrequited love, a canceled celebration. Somebody's gifts could be blocked too. Their intuition is blocked, but... This shit is a mess. This could be too. Somebody here with the Hierophant and the Judgment. Yeah, this could definitely be court. Because there's a nasty breakup here or something like that. Somebody going through. Mm. Somebody could be going to jail for domestic violence. Okay, or whatever. This could be too public scrutiny or embarrassment. Somebody feels ashamed or something like that. child what's this what's this nine of swords <laughs> people in their fucking drama yeah the king of wands what's nine of swords here with the king of wands or this could be like repressed trauma and pain that's coming up for you yeah that you need to heal from because it's making you nervous what's nine of wands with the with the king of wands yeah the queen the, the queen of pentacles in reverse you know one thing about the king of wands yeah, so the Queen of Wands, I mean, where's the Queen of Wands reverse? Yeah, Queen of Wands reverse over here. So, yeah, that's a that's a different bitch. So, and then we have this Queen of Pentacles in reverse. I feel like, you know, one thing about the King of Wands, you got to let this person be free. If they if, if they feel like they're being smothered or if they feel like they're being controlled, they're going to up and leave. So, I feel like that's what, this, that's what this King of Wands is doing to this Queen of Pentacles in reverse. And this the Queen of Pentacles in reverse could be the um, Queen of Wands in reverse. Or maybe this Queen of Wands in reverse hired this Queen of Pentacles in reverse to do magic on this King of Wands. Because I feel like they want to get the fuck up out of here. Somebody, I don't know, man. I don't know. The Queen of Pentacles in reverse is somebody too that's like insecure. Or they could be, they could have jealous tendencies. Or they could be have a nasty spirit. But on the flip side of things, this could be like... um Somebody that's disorganized or ungrounded. Okay, let me see. What's this King of Wands right here? Somebody is like, somebody could be doing magic to call this King of Wands in. <coughs> okay, Ten of Pentacles reverse. What's King of Wands, Ten of Pentacles reverse? The Emperor reverse. There's a lot going on behind the scenes, bro. There's a lot happening with these people. But this Emperor Reverse is somebody here that is losing everything. There's a lot of fighting and shit going on. The Emperor Reverse is somebody that lacks stability and security. Or somebody here could be having fraternity issues. 
Yeah, but somebody likes to abuse their power and position of authority with the emperor in reverse. This is too somebody trying to steal someone's inheritance. Or um, whoever this is, they fake their wealth and they live beyond their means. Hmm. Yeah, like, what's this Emperor Reverse doing? The Hangman? What's the Emperor Reverse with the Hangman? The Devil in the Reverse. Yeah, so you're releasing. What's the Center Pentacles kind of Reverse? The Hermit Reverse. I feel like somebody's trying to sacrifice you right now. Like, they're trying to do something to get to gain something. Because I feel like they're trying to get themselves out of something that they put themselves in. You could be dealing with a Virgo. I feel like, too, yeah, cause, because you've released something or you detached from this emperor in the reverse, this narcissist, they can't see into anything. Yeah, they're trying to look into or spy into something or trying to get something from you, but they can't do it. They can't steal it. They can't take it. Yeah, and it's because they're trying to run away from something, run away from the consequences of their actions, whatever they did. They normally know how to do a ritual to get themselves out of it, but they're they're not able to do it because you are freeing yourself from some sort of toxic behavior within yourself to where as though the spell work ain't working. So they're not, you, you can't be sacrificed, just period. Ten of Pentacles in reverse, I feel like this is you being a trendsetter or you broke a generational curse. So whatever this is, whatever this entity is, whatever this mess is that's following you, it's not working. It's not working. What's the Queen of Pentacles in reverse? Yeah, the Empress. Yeah, what's Queen of Pentacles reverse with the Empress and the Page of Cups in reverse? Yeah, jealousy, insecurities, or yeah, envy. Somebody here that doesn't want to be seen. Somebody's like trying to cloak themselves or hide in your energy. They want to be seen as the Empress or some shit like that. This Queen of Pentacles too could be sick. I feel like everybody now, whatever this was, whatever this is right here, everybody's now like scrambling to save themselves nobody is really together anymore everybody's scrambling to save themselves and pull themselves out of something <laughs> this shit is a mess yeah but we have the emperor city emperor in the reverse yeah your narcissistic ass fallen twin or whoever this is baby daddy whatever the fuck i feel like somebody here is paranoid they're scared this is a mess <clears throat> but whatever the spirit is or whatever somebody's trying to connect to you it's not working it's not working Page of Cups in reverse, too, is like bad news. It's. Mm. Promiscuity? Somebody not doing their damn shadow work or inner child healing? What's Page of Cups in reverse? This could be. Yeah, the Two of Pentacles in reverse. Page of Cups in reverse, Two of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, something is out of control. Somebody bit off more than they can chew on something, and they looking for you to save them, but they're going to try to take something from you. No. Three of Wands here is growth expansion somebody's trying to cause chaos and have it for you so that way they something for them could grow and expand it's like somebody's trying to use you or steal your essence to 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 make somebody else want to be with them i feel like this king of wands does not want this person <laughs> or whatever this is in from reverse i feel like these people somebody here doesn't want a particular person but they're trying to like do whatever they can to make somebody interested in them and i just feel like it's a no who's the empress Yeah, child, the two of cups. Yeah, I feel like you're in a relationship somewhere, Empress. You're in a relationship somewhere. You're in love. It's definitely, I don't see nobody on this thing, maybe besides this Hierophant. I don't know, but you're in a relationship, though, or there's one coming. Ain't nobody on here worth loving besides if this Hierophant is a person. Everybody else is raggedy. Or this King of Wands could be somebody good, you know. But it, your own thoughts could be getting in the way of what this could actually or what this actually is you know what i mean like you're seeing shit and that you need you need to cleanse your energy it's, it's a lot of chaos going on a lot of it so what's the empress with the two of cups yeah the three of pentacles yeah there's a partnership you learn from your past mistakes here and i feel like there, you know there's teamwork making the dream work you and somebody are in love with each other or there's there's gonna be a nice relationship coming yeah what's the ace of cups reverse <clears throat> Yeah, Knight of Cups in the reverse. So yeah, somebody here 
is just a loser. This person could be very moody. They're throwing tantrums. This could be somebody that's insincere. They, they don't really want to settle down. They want to keep having one night stands or they want to keep sleeping around with their lazy fucking ass. Or, or whoever this is is obsessive. They're a troublemaker. Like, what's the Ace of Cups in reverse, Knight of Cups in reverse? Somebody is trying to like, yeah, Four of Pentacles. They're trying to take something from you and make you take whatever they're going through. They're projecting hard. Whoever this is. This person here is a thief. They're a thief. This person could also be losing shit. I feel like somebody need to get the fuck. This is like, this person really needs to go on ahead with this energy. They are all, you need to cleanse your energy. This person keeps on trying to get in your way. person here could be sleeping around too because they feel like they lost something of value or they're trying to they're they're opportunists they're sleeping around looking for places to stay and shit <laughs> i feel like they're trying to get away from this gold digger they don't want to be around this person but i feel like they put themselves there to begin with so who cares give me a card new supportive connections exactly intuition and manifestation that was at the bottom of the deck <clears throat> So it says networking opportunities. A man and woman are enjoying an art class in a lovely environment. This car brings you increased connections with new people of like mind and heart. Now is a good time to engage in activities that will bring you together with others in more meaningful and profound ways. Perhaps you could organize a meditation group, take some classes in a field that interests you, or join a book club, bowling league, writer's group, or anything that genuinely calls to you. There's a beneficial energetic momentum that comes from your actions in this regard. As you pursue more paths of personal interest, you forge intentions in the energetic realm that are bound to pay off in real time. The new connections you make in this type of networking could bring jobs, love, opportunity, happiness, and even more financial success in the future. Start investigating the many ways you can put yourself out there and network. Expand your interests and your experiences. As you connect with kindred, others, the potential for joy will increase in your life as will your magnetic energy <clears throat> okay i'm looking at something else too so your affirmation is i open my life to the people and activities that bring fulfillment and joy i make beneficial and happy connections everywhere i go so i, I was getting with the four of pentacles reverse knight of cups this knight of cups is somebody that you thought was going to turn out to be a whole different way but they're not they're a loser they're a player and i feel like they're a hoe so there's a need for you to let this person go this is their loss you didn't lose shit they lost you. So this Ace of Cups could be repressed feelings and emotions. This person is in your energy still. And this could be causing you to feel nervous or scared or whatever the fuck. So you need to cleanse your energy because I feel like this person is the problem. They're in your energy playing around, causing you to feel nervous for what? You don't have shit to be nervous about. But you could feel like that because you're still holding on to past pain. So, yeah, this person, they're the ones with this mess. They're holding on to a lot of guilt and shame. You're not so, but yeah, the Knight of Cups is somebody that that is is charming or whatever. They know how to charm your panties off, but they turned out to be somebody that you didn't think that they were. They turned out to be a fucking clown, and they hurt you. So you need to heal and try to release and let this person go, so that way you can move forward because it's just time. Yeah, this is them trying to cause you to feel ungrounded or unstable or whatever this is. And then it's crazy because they don't even love you. They don't like you like that. They're just trying to get saved from the mess that they put themselves in. That's crazy. Like they need your energy to save them from something or they need to do whatever the fuck this is to save them. This person is crazy with all this fucking death magic and all this dumb, <laughs> this crazy ass shit that they're doing. So this was your reading, Scorpio. I hope this reading gave you clarity. Like, comment, subscribe. Turn your notification bell on. Press the all button so you won't miss my readings. And I will talk to y'all later. Bye.